Have you ever seen a tree that never seems to lose its leaves, even though they look kind of dead? Well, if you have, then you've seen today's topic, the American Beach. Hi, my name is Kathy Church. I'm a wildlife interpretive specialist with the Wildlife Resources Division, and this is another episode of, hey, what do you know? Now, the American beach has been around since the last ice age, and it's native to all of the eastern United States. It's also easily recognizable by its beautiful smooth gray bark, toothed leaves, and long cigar-shaped buds, and big sprawling branches that provide lots and lots of shade. But you probably won't see it in any kind of city, because the American beach is totally intolerant to any kind of pollution. It doesn't like dry soil, and it doesn't like hard packed soils. Now because of this, farmers have been using the American beach for generations to identify good farmable soil, because these trees will only grow where the soil is very, very healthy. Now, soil is not the only way that the American beach helped farmers. The wood was used for furniture, firewood, flooring, toys, all kinds of stuff. The nuts themselves are even edible for humans and animals alike. Although I don't suggest you go eating random things out of the woods, it's never a good idea. But farmers would feed beech nut to cattle and other livestock to help keep them healthy. This tree also helps to keep wildlife healthy as well, because beech nut is actually a great quality forage for animals like grouse and turkey and deer and bear and raccoons and possum and fox and all kinds of animals. Native Americans even searched for chipmunk caches of beech nut because they knew when they found it, they'd have a big pile of nuts in one place that had already been shelled for them. Very smart. And the other thing they found out is chipmunks never stored bad nuts. So you always knew when you found one, you had a big old cache of really good nuts. The only downside though, is that the American beach doesn't generally start producing nuts until it's at least 40 years of age. And those nuts are small, so they're really not good for commercial use. But that just means more for the wildlife. This fantastic tree has some amazing uses other than food. The wood tends to stay smooth and even, even when experiencing things like friction and water. So it was used to build things like water wheels and wooden shoes to keep your feet dry when you were walking in swampy areas. Native Americans also like to use it for a lot of different medications. For anything from soothing chapped lips to curing poison ivy, repelling mosquitoes, pain medicine for headaches, and even expelling worms from the body. Ew. <laughs> Long ago, they used thin slices of the wood to actually write on. So some of the first books were made from the wood of the beech tree. Still to this day, in some languages, the word book and the word beech tree are the same word. So, hey, what do you know? The American beech keeps its leaves all winter long. It feeds animals and humans alike, can be medicine to cure all your ills, and even paper to write your medications down on. Hey, who knew? So guys, thanks so much for joining me today, and keep an eye out for more, hey, what do you know? Have a great day.